Hello everyone, today we will be installing the latest version of Ubuntu and for that we will need its ISO file. So for that head to Google and search Ubuntu. Then click on this site. Click on download on top and you will see some options like Ubuntu desktop, server, IoT and cloud. But we will need it for desktop. So click on the version below that which is the latest version. Just after clicking on it, the download will automatically start which is 3.4 GB. Our Ubuntu ISO file is now downloaded and I have already inserted this USB which will be flashed. I will be using Rufus to flash USB. Select USB and ISO file then hit start. Now it will take time. Finally after 9 minutes it's done and now close this. These all are the required files for installation which are copied in our USB. Now same steps, plug the USB in PC and select the USB in your BIOS. Then you will see these options. I am going to select the top option for complete installation. Ubuntu has also become quite good looking like other Linux OS. Here you can choose between trying and installing then select language which is quite similar to elementary OS installation. Then continue. Just select normal installation and continue. Select erase disk option and install now. Continue and select your region. This is the main part of setup which is entering your username and password which you will use to login after installation is done. Then continue. Now Ubuntu is installing which will take few minutes. Then restart now. Make sure to remove USB after installation and before starting Ubuntu. When Ubuntu starts, you will see your username, then enter password, then you will see a pop-up like in Windows. And this is your home screen which looks pretty good. In the left, you will find some apps. This is identical to taskbar in Windows but in left. There are some applications pre-installed. In home, we can see documents, downloads, desktop and all. Let's open its app store. It has a nice collection of apps and categories as well. We should explore some games. Oh, a software update is here. So let's install it. I really like the security of Linux, which is far better than any Windows laptop. Installation is done. So now let's go to game section again. I feel like it has become slightly faster, but the games are just normal. I was overestimating it. It has Firefox browser inbuilt to access internet. On top right, you will see some important information like battery, connection, power profile, settings and power. Let's see in settings and this is our system information. So this was it, complete Ubuntu installation. Thanks for watching.